Later today, we get the Bank of England policy decision. This should be an interesting one for two reasons. One, it comes on the heels of a memorable Fed decision in which the central bank opted to go with the bigger 50 basis point rate cut. And two, it also comes a day after UK inflation data came out hotter than expected. The implication here is that we are looking at some serious monetary policy divergence between the Fed and BOE, with the BOE having even less flexibility to consider a rate cut with inflation a much bigger concern right now in the UK than it is in the US. Technically speaking, the pound has recently broken out to the top side after clearing the 2023 peak and continues to show signs of wanting to extend the run out from the massive 2022 low. The more apparent policy divergence appears to set the stage for this run to continue towards the next major upside objective in the form of the 2021 high around 142.50. The only clear downside risk right now is the possibility that a lot of this is now nearly full fully priced into the market, which could set the stage for a short-term pullback on a sell-the-fact type reaction. But even if we do see such a pullback, the trend is clear and the fundamentals are hard to ignore, which continues to suggest the pound will be well-supported on dips. That's all for now.